everyone, so my name is uh, Boumedian Hamzi. I am a Marie Curie Fellow at uh, the Department of Mathematics of uh, Imperial College London. On behalf of the organizers, I'm happy to uh, welcome you to the second symposium on machine learning and dynamical systems that is being hosted online by the Fields Institute. So this is uh, the second edition. <coughs> so the first edition was uh, organized at Imperial College London in February 2019. So this second edition was supposed to be on site at uh, the Fields Institute, but uh, due to the current uh, situation, we had to move it uh, online. Uh, as we all know, the, there is a lot of interest in the field of uh, machine learning in uh, larger society and in the research community in particular. Uh, so machine learning is viewed as the solution to many uh, intractable problems, but there is no uh, understanding of the true limits and potential of, uh, of this field. On the other side, the theory of dynamical systems that has been developed in the late 1800s, uh, especially through the efforts of uh, Poincaré and Lyapunov, has been proposing methods to analyze complex systems when the model uh, is known. And as we all know, uh, the, the, most of the methods in dynamical system theory are uh, applicable to uh, low dimensional systems. Um, so the goal of uh, this uh, symposium is to fill the gap between machine learning and dynamical systems. Um, uh, applying, uh, the first direction is to apply machine learning to uh, dynamical systems. Uh, and uh, here, the goal is to analyze dynamical systems on the basis of observed data rather than to attempt, than attempt to study them analytically. So this will allow to extend the boundaries of the classical theory of dynamical systems towards uh, high dimensional systems in particular. And the other direction is dynamical system theory for machine learning. And then the goal here is to analyze uh, algorithms of machine learning using tools from the theory of dynamical systems and this will uh, will allow to give solid foundations to the existing methods and understand their true potential and limits. So as pointed out by uh, Steve Smale about 15 years ago in the introduction of uh, one of the books, the interaction between dynamical systems and learning theory is an important problem and he mentioned that the unification of dynamical system theory and uh, learning theory is a major problem. He also mentioned that another problem is to develop uh, a comparative study of useful algorithms currently available and to give uh, unity to these uh, algorithms. So the unification is also important from the point of view of uh, philosophy of science because most of the scientific uh, methods in the modern world are based on combining between uh, empirical methods and uh, rational methods. So here in our case dynamical system theory is viewed as the rational part and the machine learning is being viewed as the empirical part since it's uh, data-based. Uh, so this uh, symposium means a lot to me in particular because it's directly related to a personal intellectual journey that started about uh, 10 years ago when I met Jake Bouvry uh, at uh, Duke University. So he was just finishing his PhD in uh, machine learning with uh, Thomas Ocodio and uh, had background in control dynamics, uh, background in control dynamic systems at that time, and uh, we were interested in exploring uh, problems at the intersection of these uh, two areas. So um, we adopted a particular point of view, which is the point of view of kernel methods for dynamical systems, and uh, I'm hoping to learn uh, other approaches in this symposium. Uh, and, uh, and also hoping that this symposium will take the, the field uh, of machine learning and dynamical systems to the next stage. Thank you and looking forward to seeing you in the symposium.